Hello, finesse again. We are out here on day one of summoning of the Eclipse Festival. We got the pregame going down right now. It's like 1.30 p.m. If you're just joining us, we got here last night, not for the pre-party, but we actually got into some of the pre-party. I'm not sure if there's gonna be a vlog for that, but I'll post clips somewhere, Instagram. Make sure you follow at the Festival Finesser. It took us 14 hours to get here, man. So we're surprised we made it to the pre-party. We were set up in the dark. It was a little chaotic, but we're out here. We got a nice little village. We got Prosecute, one, Digitus, that two. I'm trying to see Spass, but we might show with the homies and just go in early. But enjoy the intro. We'll see you guys for the first set in the venue. Can I get it? All right, guys, it's like two o'clock. We're out here with the squad. We got, yeah, that's what I'm talking about, bro. We got homies from New Jersey, New York, New Orleans, Florida. Florida. I got John. I got the Florida fam out here. We're all pit fans, so us together is gonna be a problem. We're gonna get rowdy, and security was not letting us mosh last night during the pre party, so. It's going to be an interesting weekend, so we're going in for the 2 p.m. set. We got Digitus and we got Ben's Mixer. I'm not sure where we're going to end up, but we'll see y'all after security. Yeah. <laughs> Yo, Mike! Yes! I was just about to do a clip, so we're coming in from the camping entrance this way. And this is the parking entrance. What up, boy? <laughs> Scano fam is out here. Oh shit, the whole gang is out here, bro. All right, squad pick time. You know what's up. Hello, squad. All right, so this is the path we walked through last night that was very spookily lit. Now it's just looking like a path. But we do have the entire pit fam out here. So, you know it's gonna get rowdy. Ape shit, ape shit. Who are we walking into right now? We're going to the cave. Digitus. Digitus. Two o'clock. We also got Ben's mixer. Ben's so, mixer's in the cave if that's where we're going. I don't know where we're going, but we'll see y'all for the first set. That in here, get everything it wants. All right, we're in here. So bad. Security is regular. Alright guys, it's 315. We got the main stage going off right now. But we're going into the cave to see what's up. I don't even know who's playing. I forget, but I got you. We'll see y'all when we see y'all. A weird fear of like like I'll think once in a while when I'm in there. Digitus on the main stage, I think. We're just gonna try and, you know, utilize the daytime while we can because I feel like we're gonna spend a lot of time in the cave and it's dark as fuck in there. So yeah, we'll see you guys at the main stage. All right guys, it's 412. We're here at Tainan at main stage. We're supposed to be seeing that in the cave right now, but <laughs> we got a little drunk ride right now. I'm gonna get some clips for him. Where do you go? 
looks funny we're making our way back into the festival i got too late too early but we're making our way back yeah this guy got me fucked You're up welcome. off this single bag a couple bags actually but we're making our way back inside we missed fast we missed everybody i wanted to see early but we're getting in for the next time we're warm we're ready so we're gonna get it we'll see y'all inside Can we get the lights on in here, please? Listen guys, everybody over here waiting for the cave, we are really sorry for the wait, we really are. But for safety concerns, we have to have you guys back up and move out to the right here. We're gonna set up some infrastructure to make it a little bit easier for you guys to get in. It's completely at capacity down there, but for you guys' safety, we need to back, disperse, just clear that out a little bit, and then we're gonna set up a barricade to make sure you guys get in there safe. Please, safety first, then teamwork, all right? Thank you, guys.
Please excuse the interruption, guys, but because YouTube is not paying me big bills, I have resorted to sponsoring some of my videos by smaller companies in the EDM and festival scene. This video is being sponsored by Tripper Clothing Co., a company I actually connected with at Summoning Fest. Tripper is all about seeking the unknown and returning to nature, and they have a bunch of dope designs inspired by the things they love most and things that really impacted their life. And these designs are available for men and women in tees, long sleeves, hoodies. They even have accessories like beanies and stickers. So if you guys are interested in supporting local companies that are supporting the festival and base scene, definitely check out the link in my description box below for their online store. And if you cannot support financially, you can still support for free by following the social media, which is also in the description box below. So big ups again, and thank you to Tripper for the merch at Summoning, and thank you for sponsoring this video. Now let's get back to the content. All right, guys, we just left the main stage during Leo Tricks. No, I'm sorry. We saw Leo Tricks. We're leaving during Faizo back to back. We think. Uber. No, we, that's definitely when we left. Oh, but yeah, yeah. Th during that set, or maybe it was Leo Tricks, they announced that there is no more cave for the rest of the night. But they are having, in fact, back to back Samplifier and EPROM extend the night. Now it's supposed to end at like 11 or 12. Now it's ending at 1. So. We're gonna get those two sets for sure, but the cave, like, you know, Cod Dubs and Al Ross after that, it seemed like it got cut. And that was a big set I was trying to see, because those were the homies, and it was gonna be rowdy as fuck, but now we are all just in the main stage area, which is fine, I'm cool with that. There's plenty of fire acts in the main stage, but it would've been nice to have that, like, festival vibe. And we were here, I came for the cave, you know, I came to see Rhythm in a cave, and now there's no cave, so now it's just main stage. Which is fine. But still. The artists here are crazy. That's why I don't care. You know what I'm saying? There's so much underground talent here, and everybody that's here is here for the same reason. We're here for sudden death. We're here for underground. We're here for heavy. We're here for mosh pits. We're here for aggressive. Aggression. Kind of. So. Aggression? Yeah. We'll see you guys back inside for. Um, I don't even know who. We got in effect back to back Samplifier. I'm like 90% sure. Let's go. Let's go. We got her helmet. She's ready to go. No face injuries this festival. Alright, I'll see you in the pit.
guys we are back at camp it's like 12 40 ish 12 45 i don't even know my phone's dead i don't have a watch but we're all a little confused because they closed the cave then they extended the main stage so we left after sudden death back to back marauder and then there was eprom so we don't know if the after party is even happening because they announced that the stage was the cave was closed but the cave is where the after party is so we don't know if they're reopening it for the after party so we're just kind of chilling we are a little beat but we're probably gonna try and go and get some cave action and then um you know we'll see what happens back here at camp but that's the update and i did miss a lot of my daytime sets but the night was fucking crazy so we out here we're doing it and we'll see you guys for the next clip all right guys it's about to be 1 a.m it's probably like 12 50 something we're making our way to the after party in the cave we just got word that it's almost at capacity, which means it's going to be crowded as fuck. So I guess we'll see what it's looking like and see where the night takes us. guys 3 a.m we're back at camp and we're going to sleep i'm going to sleep i'm tired after party was cool but spent more time waiting for sudden death to come on than i did see spent time seeing sudden death y'all know what i'm trying to say i didn't see sudden death for very long stay for like 30 minutes and then 
but it was cool. Got to see him come in. Got to see him, you know, some clips from the rail. So it was cool. But yeah, I'm gonna go to bed now. I'm fucking tired. We'll see y'all tomorrow. Day two coming at you.